Hey guys, this is a uh, new Minecraft video, and I'm beta testing in 1.2.20 beta test right now. That's an ocean monument over there, but um, yeah, there's all kinds of new character animal models and everything. They even have a new swimming animation that I really love. There's dolphins, there's fish that you can actually like see as a physical thing. There is, uh, this lovely little tool with Riptide. It's a trident with Riptide. It'll launch you up and then you can glide. And it's raining, you can use the rain to, uh, glide from place to place. I'm trying to, uh, get onto the surface from the water while doing the fast swimming is a bit weird. But, um, more on that later. Right now, this is another trident with impaling, loyalty, and channeling. Normally, if you're not in creative and you throw a trident, you don't get it back. Unless you can find where you threw it. But with loyalty, that'll eventually come back to me. Like, say... See? I came back. And this one will come back, too. See? Also, with the uh, new water physics... We can now swim to one block, one block spaces. And if I try to swim like I normally would, nothing. Go over a little, nothing, nothing. You can also place water in places where you couldn't place it before. And it'll flow like it normally would. Like right here and right here. Which means farming is going to get kicked up to a whole nother level. Because now you don't need like whole blocks of water. You can just put stairs and place buckets of water inside the stairs and farm that way and change. It'll completely re revolutionize farming. Also, there's auto generated structures underwater now. I think that might be one over there. Give me a second. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's one, yeah. It's a sunken ship that's sideways. Sweet. But, um, yeah, you don't even have to use, like, doors and stuff. You can just swim into them. And, like, see, there's stuff here. Underwater. In a chest. And I just swam under and swam under. Yeah, there's all kinds of new stuff. And I'm going to take that because I don't know what it leads to. I've seen a few of these, but never actually used one. Apparently, there's a treasure over here. I didn't know about any treasure over here, but there's one. Right here. Ish. So, I'm gonna dig it up. Dig it up. Boom, boom, boom. Dig it. I don't see any treasure right there, so maybe if I go over a few more and then back and over and back in this tree. Doop, 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 doop. 
check what's about the middle. I want to see if I actually get anything from this. Apparently there's treasure here and it can't be too far down. I'm not seeing any treasure though. Unless it's like in a cave underwater somewhere. So. Seriously not seeing any treasure, which is weird, but maybe they just haven't finished the uh, coding for that yet. But, um, yeah, I... Check several places in that area, no treasure, but hey, can't complain. It is, after all, just a video game. But yeah, um, you've actually already seen a few new blocks, like these spruce half doors and stuff. I'm gonna get rid of those and that, put those down there. swim down here and show you guys um, this is without mods I have no air pockets you can now bring, build like sewer grates and all kinds of crazy shit into your world more interactive water is really something this game has needed for a long time you can also build like really good aquariums now and actually have fish in them cause you know that's lit but, um, be careful with glass, because for some reason, if you try to, like, with glass panes, I don't know if they're gonna fix it or not, but glass panes interact just like these would with the water, if you don't do it right. Which is a bit weird, but, hey, no question it. Also, if you don't put it in a full block, like a source block, Still does the air pocket. Which is kind of weird, but not at the same time. But yeah, you can do all kinds of crazy stuff and have like secret entrances to bases that look like one block. One block spots. Most people just assume that you can't enter. But you can now, and it's, it's great. I love it. This will take like setting things up and pranking people to like whole nother levels. Also, this, like, one-shot pretty much anything that's not in the ocean. Come on. Aiming is pretty hard, though, because it's got some weird dropouts out the water compared to inside the water. Because, like, inside the water, it's different. That would be outside the water, because those dolphins are freaking annoying. They'd be good at dodging. And it's part of their code, but whatever. I'm gonna attack one of these. One. Two. I just two shot at a guardian. I don't know many weapons that can do that, like even fully enchanted diamond swords would have trouble doing that. Unless you got, like, god enchantments, but that's besides the point. Also, um, there's a bunch of new blocks and stuff, which is also nice. I have to do that to get rid of that, and get rid of that, 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 and that. But they don't have any new textures yet, sadly, but hey, yes, it'll get there eventually. It's a work in progress. But, um, they added new wood, and they, I think, changed the leaves? Yeah, they did. But, um, yeah, they added stripped oak wood, and all the different ones have a stripped floor now. 
which looks way better, by the way. Like for walls, it looks way better. It's gonna bring a whole new level to build. Like it's crazy. Like you could do crazy patterns and And you can do stripes of all kinds. Damn it. It's still a bit glitchy, but it's because it's beta. Those glitches will probably be gone by the time it reaches the full version, but hey, it looks nice. Like, really nice. Not really sure how you get it yet. Maybe it's like something that you craft, or maybe you need shears. There's also all kinds of underwater structures that are going to be generating, like, underwater ravines. And sunken ships are just everywhere in this world. Like, literally, just because it's mostly ocean, they're just everywhere. And, like, these are water ravines are crazy. They have, like, magma blocks in them sometimes and stuff. Which, um, if you don't know, magma blocks will eventually be able to drag things downward. But, like, yeah, there's all kinds of crazy stuff. Fuck you, it's because it's saving, I'm lagging so hardcore. But yeah, this is also one of the newer mobs called a Drowned. It's like the underwater version of a zombie. But yeah, there's also these like house type things. That, like, totally remind me of Atlantis. Like, I'm not joking, they, they remind me of, like, so much Atlantean stuff that I've seen in, like, cartoons and movies and all the Atlantean stuff. And it's just, like, an underwater thing. It, it exists, and it looks sick. Sometimes you get a little glitchy, though, with um, the uh, new water physics. But, um, yeah, they're, they're, these are just, like, throughout, like, the whole world, everywhere, underwater. Like, look, it's a fucking castle. A castle tower. That's what that is. It's filled up with gravel and nothing else. As it fell into the sea. Under the sea. Under the sea. Don't do it, it's like that tower, it's like that ticket from you. Do 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 do. An unbreaking fishing rod, ammo, that stuff. More stuff. Let's Discord. But, um, yeah, there's all kinds of crazy stuff now in the water. There's corals and all kinds of stuff that you can place underwater and only underwater, which will make underwater builds look way better, in my opinion. They're going to come out way nicer now. Like, you could do a whole underwater city type thing if you tried hard enough. But, um, damn it. Yeah, there I go. But, um, yeah. I'd love to see what you guys think of my video. And what you guys think of these new features. So.
So, yeah. I'm gonna do my favorite thing right now. I, I just love this feature where you can just swim through warm block spaces. It's going to change the way we do everything now. Like, literally, it will change the way all kinds of different things are done now, and it's just beautiful, and I love it. Because, like, now you never know when something's going to be hidden. Because, like, you could swim through one block spaces, which means you could hide the entire, like, rooms inside mountains with, like, a little one block space. You could mine a one block tunnel underwater. But like legit, give me a second. I gotta get rid of that. Look. As long as there's water, I can keep swimming through one block space. <laughs> Come on, yay! Come on. I think I glitched out the game and teleported, but hey, no problem all. Yeah, I think I glitched out the game and teleported, but hey. <laughs> there it is. Okay. And that give me some water, 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 and then just fill this sucker up with water. Oh, hey. No. But, like, this is what I love about this game. There's so much you can do to it now. With, like, the new water features and everything, this is gonna take Minecraft to, like, a whole nother level. This and this. Just tunnel right through the mountain and just line it with water and use water breathing potions. Just take Minecraft to like a whole nother level with map building. I try to come on straight through before the uh, video ends. It'll end at 20 minutes. So while that's happening, you should uh, hit subscribe, like, and comment on this video, and tell me what you think of these new fe features and functions of the game, and what you think might and might not make it through the beta test. Because I really want to know you guys' opinions before I start giving, like, feedback and stuff. And it's a little bit afternoon, and I'm making a Minecraft video because I have no freaking life. But hey, it's what I do. At least I'm not as old as Log.Zip still playing Minecraft. Oh, the shade. I love throwing shade at him. Like, he's a great YouTuber, don't get me wrong, but I will throw shade at him all day long, just for shits and giggles. Like, it's not like I dislike him or anything, he's a great YouTuber, he makes amazing content, but like... The dude's almost like in his 40s or something like that. And he's still playing like Minecraft and shit. And again, I'm almost 20 and I'm still playing, so... Can't really say too much. I need to look at that. We made it straight through an island. And we have a secret tunnel now through an island. That we can use to get from one end of the island to the other. And hey look, it's an underwater cave. Oh, and those days were like mining. And you, like, saw these spaces, and you were like, fuck. Nope, not 